since we were near the cemetery yesterday we thought we'd come up today bring the hounds for a little walk and have a look at the 1931 earthquake monument pretty big part of history for New Zealand actually but certainly for Hawke's Bay perhaps our biggest natural disaster in terms of lives and property lost bit of a sombre spot here it's the site of New Zealand's largest community grave victims of the 1931 earthquake and there's a big monument huge quake that affected Napier and Hastings I think it killed 256 odd people 80 something of them are in the cemetery most of them are here in this community grave some of them are interred elsewhere in the cemetery They released a report, uh, might have been day before yesterday, about earthquakes, funnily enough. And they're saying that in the next 50 years, we're essentially almost guaranteed to have this massive earthquake off the subduction zone just off our east coast pretty much exactly east of where we live that will cause an enormous amount of shaking and very very likely massive tsunami as well pretty scary stuff especially for an emergency service worker but I guess uh, you take take it as it comes. Christchurch was a pretty big deal. It was certainly an interesting feature in my career. But perhaps it'll be different if it kicks off where I live. Just heading home after today's a little bit unusual outing at the cemetery. Angus is slinging drawl. And it's time for us to go. Nearly dinner time. Dog's having steak and kidney for dinner. It's all pretty good times. Come on Angus, let's go.